All right, ladies and gentlemen, the Easter update is live. Welcome back to Dial R's Twilight Tactics. Uh, in this video, we're going to be going over the entire entirety of the Easter update that uh, just launched today, April 6, 2023, in Eternal Evolution. Now, this is your main, uh, I'd say, your portal window. So let's, let's start right at the beginning. So if we go to the main page, uh, firstly, what they added uh, is these bunnies. So I'm going to show you where they are. This is going to be really easy. I don't know if they're going to move every time, but there's one. Boom. Thank you. Okay, cool. Paint. God gave me some paint. That's good. Boom. That one gave me some more paint. And then the next one, the last one, let's see, it should be in your, no, not there. It's in your base right there. Boom. Okay, cool. There we go. We got all three. So let's go to the Easter thing. If you see where's your rabbit, you can click on that. You see that I got three out of three. I don't know if these are going to respawn. Right? I don't know. I would assume they're going to respawn <clears throat> in the same places or just slightly different. But they stand out like a sore thumb. You're going to be able to find them very easily. You should really click on them uh, because you do need them. Now, uh, this basically just takes you over to your uh, summoning because we are getting double chips because it's the Easter carnival. <clears throat> so there you go. That's that self-explanatory. Pull all your limited tickets. Uh, bank up your data chips or your limited chips for future either hero copies or gene hybrids. This is to the store. <clears throat> it's really weird. <coughs> they want you to buy stuff for ungodly prices. Um, you get a little, you get one rainbow paint, which is worth, I think, 5,000 crystals here. And this Assassin's Cloak for $100. Not worth it, in my opinion. Uh, they put in the Gene Hybrid 2 in here. Again, for me, $100. Bucks, no, not worth it. These speed-ups are also really nice, though. Uh, so I, I can see... This is Kraken food. I can see Kraken's buying this. This is the Leo skin. Which... I don't know. It, it is what it is. I don't like it. It is kind of funny how this freaking bunny... Is this where it is? Where it jumps all over him? I don't know. A carrot sword? Yeah. This, I like the bunny part. That's kind of cool how it kind of bugs him and ticks him off. That's kind of funny, right? And then he chucks him back in his back. So, but the way to get this skin is to pay $100, which is absolutely insane. It's insanity. Don't do it. And then you see these other bundles have paints. And then maybe the only one that's worth it. I got to move my head so you can see it. Uh, two green paints and five speed ups for ten bucks. I don't. I don't know if you need it. I don't know. This these bundles last for twenty days, so don't buy anything until the end. Uh, is my what I recommend, ladies and gentlemen. So that goes there. Um, so yeah, this is limited. We'll talk about the Easter egg painting last, probably. But let's talk about the Easter battles now. I made a separate video on the best teams to do these battles. So go check that out if you're seeing this video first. I'm not going to get ha get into this, but these events are set up the same way as the Christmas event and the Valentine's Day event. It's the same kind of thing. Three separate events that stagger. They're released on different days. If you need to know which days, they are right here. They're all open on day seven. And um, the other ones stagger between days, days one, two, three, four, and five, right? And you are you get rewards twice. You get daily rewards and then all time at the end rewards. Your daily ranking, there's your boy right there in on his main account in first. Daily rankings are really, really good. I, I, I really like this. So you're gonna get these every day. These eggs are the currency for you to buy paint. Okay? Uh, but red runes are is excellent. Uh, the yellow, I could take it or leave it. Uh, XP, sure, I, I could always use that, whatever. But really, the, the red runes and these eggs are the uh, primary reward currency that you're going to want every day. And as you see, it doesn't go down a whole lot. The top three get 30, 20, 25. Uh, top five is 20. And then, it, you know, top 10 is, is okay, 18. Then it starts to fall off, right? But at least for the course of seven days, you're going to get 14 red runes. I think this event is open for seven days. I think these ones are only open for seven days. I think the paint ones are open for um, 20 days. Yeah, right here. See, this? these ones are only open till, for day seven, for seven days, a week. So those are your daily rewards. And then the more points you score 
or the highest points you score um, in each event is going to go towards your all-time score, your all-time ranking. As you see, again, uh, I'm number one because it's only one day. And then, uh, but my, my free, this account, my free-to-play count is 49th. So, yeah. And then at the end of the event, at the end of this week, next Thursday, you're going to wake up and you're going to get these rewards in your inbox, depending on where you placed. So the, uh, the pretty gold frame is only for the top 10. And then the top three get a full gene hybrid. Uh, these red runes are freaking excellent. These, this is an excellent reward. Red runes, they're huge amounts. That's nice. As you see, even if we start scrolling down, top 50 get 30. You know, I'd say the top 50, the rewards start to get a little weak. Uh, definitely top 10 is what, is what you want to shoot for. So that's how the ranking and the rewards work for the Easter battles. Which, again, as I said, is probably only seven days. Um, yeah, you see Easter Party event ends in seven days. Now, the Painter goes 20 days. Okay? So, if we go right back out to the main screen, you see here, you got your Easter Party, which is this whole banner, which includes the battles. Okay. Seven days. But, this Painter is going on through the, the entire thing. Um, but if I want to go back to the battles, you see your missions, your daily missions are going to give you eggs, right? So, which is kind of weird because this event is what's going to feed the paint event. And then your dailies or your achievements also give you, um, the eggs. So the achievements you can only get once, the dailies you can get every day. As you see, there's gene hybrids in here. There's lots of gene hybrids. This is cool. Let's let's see if we can count them up. Okay. Do I have any? No. Okay. So lots and lots of eggs or egg tokens or paint tokens. And then we got 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, uh, 24, 26, 28, 30. You get half a gene hybrid. If you can complete all of these, uh, you're not going to be able to do that if you're a very, very low account though, right? Because there's some of these are based on score. Uh, some of these are based on just the amount of times you do the uh, battle. Uh, but some of them, as you, if we go down here, are based on score. You see, like I didn't reach the highest level of points in Bombland on this account. Am I going to be able to? Probably not. So you are going to miss out on, on some of this stuff if you're a lower level account. So we've, we've hashed this to death. That is how the battles work. Um, now, the reason why I think... Not that one. The reason why I think there's the dispar disparity between this timer and the other one, especially since uh, after seven days, you're not going to be able to get the tokens you need to buy all these paints. You can still buy the paints daily with crystals. Um, as you see, I've bought all of these ones. They have a limit of three, two, two, two. I do recommend uh, very, very highly that you spend your crystals every day and you buy all of these. This event is going to be very, very crystal intensive. Buy out the crystal ones every day. Don't miss that. This store refreshes every day. And then these ones down here for crystals are unlimited. So after the, the battle ends, or after the Easter battles end in a week, the only way you're going to be able to get paint... Is likely from crystals right so keep that in mind because the rewards you get from painting are huge so uh, limited tickets uh, right off the bat for the first egg and then we got limited tickets and a frame more limited tickets now we got a gene hybrid shard 10 gene hybrid shards now we got a Rickert copy with more gene hybrid shards, and you're going to get a full gene hybrid if you can complete everything. This one gives you the the Ravenna skin, gives you some red runes, more gene hybrids, a full gene hybrid, and 15. So you can get two, two gene hybrids with this event. These are, these rewards are huge, and then a freaking triple S hyper evolution crystal. That is insane if you can make it to the end, but. I think this is going to be a matter of do you have enough crystals and do you uh, have enough paint in order to get to the end? Because this one, as you see, uh, I think I, I, I waited. I didn't want to start this one until I made this video with you guys. So I need, I need 
17 blue paint and I need 19 yellow paint. Okay, so let's go to the store. As you see, I have 141 eggs from doing the battles for today. So what was that again? Uh, oh, I need 17 blue, 19 yellow. So blue, uh, let's do the yellow first. I need 19. So 19, that's gonna eat up 50. And then I need 17 blue, right? Boom. Okay, there we go. So I got my paints for this egg. Um, I don't know why I keep clicking that. Now I can start painting because I meet the requirements. So start painting. Boom. And as you see, this is why I think the timer's so long. Because these timers are going to ramp up quite a bit by the time you get to this last egg. Uh, which you can't see underneath my screen. Which requires super paint and then uh yeah this this is gonna be i think this is gonna be tough guys to get this this super paint alone costs five thousand crystals now i did it again now that the egg is painting uh, you see i did buy uh, some accelerators i did i already pre-purchased some I, I bought these ones the limit and then i bought a bunch because i have a lot of crystals on this account I bought a bunch of these, right? So there we go. Let's do another 2200. I did. I hit the back button again. So now, um, each time you click it once is going to increase it by an hour. So let's just wrap it right to the end. I'm going to eat up 15 of my speed tokens. Boom. I got the rewards for this egg. Now we have to start the next egg, which is going to ramp up a difficulty. So I need 12 green. Let's go to the rabbit shop. And as you see, I can only buy six. So now if I wanted to buy more, I'd have to buy it with crystals, which I, I, I am going to do because you do want to start painting. Uh, bef you don't want to end the day not having an egg on cooldown painting, which this sounds stupid in this game. Like, like yeah, this event, it, it doesn't fit the theme of this game. But the rewards are, are so good that you're going you're gonna to have to do it. So I need six more green. So let's go to the rabbit shop. And let's buy six for 6,000 crystals. Oh, boy. Uh, my free-to-play account, uh, my baby free-to-play account, definitely can't do this. I think I only have 20,000 crystals. So now I need 20 yellow. So I can buy a few more of these. So now I need 18 yellow. So let's go to this one. Let's buy 18. Boom, 5,400 crystals. Ugh. Ugh. And now I need 30 blue. Which is the cheapies. So I need 29 blue. There we go. Now, again, keep in mind, this event is open for 20 days. You probably don't have to rush this. I don't know what... I don't know how far you can get, though. Just relying on the tokens that you get... From the battles. I, I don't know that, guys. I, we're not going to know that until we get closer. We might get um, gift codes to give us more paint. We don't know. So now we start painting. Boom. But now, as you see, this one was, what, 15 hours? Now it's gonna. Now it doubled. Now it's 30 hours. So if this doubles every time, so 60 hours, which is days. Let's, let's, let's write this down. I want to do the math here. So, the first one was 15 hours. Then it's 30. Then it's 60. Then it's 120. Oh, God. This is going to ramp up a lot. Two, four, if it ramps up like this. 240. Four, oh, 480. Yeah, it, it, I'm not even going to do the math. I was writing it down, but you get the point days on days on days so you are gonna need these accelerators too so let's let's ramp that up boom 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 i probably didn't need to do that really i probably only needed to do like 10 so that tomorrow morning when i woke up i could do the next one right so keep in mind use these strategic strategically so now this is going to unlock on me during the night but it is still going to be unlocked in the morning but i probably could have saved some of these speed ups for the next one right so don't burn all your speed ups and now this one's just going to sit there and hatch. So, yeah. That's it, guys. That is the 
Easter event for Eternal Evolution. Um, the rewards are really, really good. Uh, I will say that. Uh, the events are fun. The battles are fun. I like that. Go check out my previous video on, on, on the best teams for the battles. I don't have a video up for the middle one. Circus of Idar. Um, Idar is the character from... Uh, he's already in game. So, Idar is right here. Right? Yes, this is Idar. In the Olay of Truth, which means... This boss is likely going to be assassin based. So you're probably going to need Rickert to get this. Yay. Luckily, though, I have Rickert and I have Bailey. I have all the assassins on my main account, so I'm going to be good. So this one required um, Panda. Uh, Circus is going to probably require Rickert. And Bombland pretty much required Nord and Ravenna. So, the three top tier characters needed to max out these events. So, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to wrap that up right there. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, put them down in the, dis or in the comments. And we will discuss. If not, I'll see you in the next one, guys. Cheers. Peace. Bye-bye.